<laughs> so if I may, this is interesting because I wrote this down, but this is down on my notes a little. And okay. it, we were, we're already getting into the deep water. And I'm like, okay. whoa, uh, I love this, by the way. Thank you for this. Uh, one of the things that I was thinking about with Richard Dawkins being a uh, biology expert on this and AO by AO biogenesis, if you will, like mm-hmm. the fact that f- m- like different elements combined under the right circumstances in some way we 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 believe that this is how life began how it happened in the correct environment and exactly how that's the complex part we aren't really able to exactly reenact but does that translate somewhat into what you're saying here about the universe is that there's something here we know we have the components we have the idea we just can't like we don't oh there's a picture of it look it just happened and we don't have the evidence of it actually taking place uh, we don't we don't have the full theory yet, but uh, uh, you know Richard made more of an analogy. It's kind of pompous to me to suggest that this argument was the same as as Darwin's argument, but you know his was <laughs> profound. But it, well, yeah. and and he spent years validating the data. But the idea is very similar. When 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 Darwin came up with the idea of evolution and 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 came up with all sorts of evidence from looking at at, at fossils and looking at existing species, he didn't know about DNA. He didn't know the mechanism of genetic uh, replication and, and mutation. Uh, he didn't know any of that. He just said, look, it's plausible. If I look at these things and I, I can demonstrate that there's real good evidence for evolution of diversity, I don't know the mechanism of that evolution. And in some sense, it's the same. All the evidence points to a universe from nothing, although we don't know the specific evidence by which it came into being. And by the way, and that's important about evolution too, Evolution, natural selection explains the diversity of life from a common ancestor, but it doesn't explain the origin of the common ancestor. That we still haven't, um, don't have a full theory of. We have lots of arguments suggesting it, it's plausible, and, and all the time people are arguing for ways that you, natural mechanisms on Earth, deep in deep ocean, or in, in, in layers of, of various um, uh, crystal layers, that you could develop a separate replicating object uh, with a with a membrane and etc but we don't know we don't have those exact steps yet i suspect in the next 25 years we will but we don't have that but it's but there's no evidence to suggest it's impossible and in fact every bit of evidence to suggest it's likely and and it's in that sense the beginning of life and the beginning of the universe are on the same uh footing in the sense that we have a plausible mechanisms but we don't know the details yet 